Hello everybody and welcome back. This is Mon PJC and this is my Let's Play Minecraft channel. And I am here back at the Castle Keep where Halo Phoenix has been planting a few trees. We were running out of wood. So she came over here and did a bit of tree planting, which is fantastic. It means we'll have loads. I have been doing loads of work since you were last here. You may remember that in this big empty space here last time, we had a train dropping off loads of stuff for us. Well, the train has gone. The reason being is I decided it probably wasn't a good idea to have a train coming right the way up here on the track. So we've gone underground. So I've got this entrance way here just temporarily for now. And we've taken a left turn here with the track which comes through and we've got a brand new little area which I'm building which has got this chest in it which allows as a buffer for the train cart to unload but I've got it I've got it switched off at the moment I've got a bit of a branch line there so the train doesn't come through when I finish this this now goes down into what I will now call the halo phoenix pre-smelting area so we have here, uh, it's a bit difficult to tell standing here in the corner, but this is a regular sorting system. And in this sorting system, we collect coal, iron, uh, gold, and cobblestone, that's it, which will come through here. Let's hop around here so you can have a better view. So this will all come in through this hopper chain down from that car, from the mining we've done deep, deep down underneath. These then go into these chests and underneath these chests, I've got some more hoppers which feed along to, behind the wall, a furnace. Which means the furnace can get properly queued up with a regular supply of coal and all those other items ready for smelting. What the idea of this room is then is the smelting then takes place behind here, goes up for an item elevator and back into our item hopper chain at the top here. So I've left some mixed room for expansions, put in some other things like kelp or food that we might want to process on pre-cook uh, as well before it goes back into here. And we've got a gap in the chain here so we don't fill this next area, which is going to be the giant sorting room that I've already got some chests in place there which are going to be for our main minerals like gold and iron and everything uh, which is going to be smelted down and they will then come in through here this room however is huge as you can see it goes right the way around here uh, let's hop through the middle of the machine here and up these stairs to show you what we've got. So this is going to be underneath the castle. We're actually underneath the main part of the castle right now. And in here, we are building this big sorting machine with that area there for our primary uh, expensive materials. And then we're gonna have stone collection coming through here. And then you can hear the uh, the animals above us there. And then along this side here is going to be for any other items we start collecting a lot of. And this room area here is going to be dug down so that we can access the chests at the bottom here, which will have our item frames on and our items can be collected from these chests underneath. So this is all just temporarily in place while we do that. So that's what I'm going to be working on. Uh, for the next day or two probably while I'm putting together this video and we're also going to dig out a huge hole above us which is going to be in line with the walls of the castle up there so we can actually get some idea of where the floors are going to go and the interior of the castle as well so we have got a huge amount of stuff going on here so I am going to disappear crack on with this have a nice cup of coffee and see how far I can get before I come back and see you next time. Hi, so just in case you were wondering, I've dug a hole, a very, very big hole right there behind me. Yep, so this is the keep and you can actually see right down inside there 
is where we've actually got our sorting system and it looks pretty massive from up here i've got a couple of steps here let's just lean in and have a look so yep this is taking me a couple of hours to dig out this entire room area so the floor there goes right down level with the bottom sets of chests the hoppers that come in through here supply our materials to these hoppers and the chests and then they're then sorted through this area here in the corner is where our automated smelter is so down at this level down there that's going to be very much our basement our secret stores for all our materials etc and then we're going to have a layer up here in between which might be for barracks or different rooms etc and then up here we're going to have more rooms so we've probably got enough room for four layers of rooms with the main castle area being at the top and the houses on the top hi i'm back again and i've been busy working away and i've now been joined by halo phoenix hello hello, hello. how are you i'm good how are you I'm not being bad. I've been really busy. Have you? It looks yes. like it. So you may have noticed I've made a really big hole yep. in here. Um, holy moly. <laughs> holy, mo holy, holy moly. Holy moly. moly. Yes. Uh, you were very helpful in doing this because you were digging. Oh, I'm just moving my mouse mat around and my screen's going everywhere. <laughs> you did a lot of help digging this out, didn't you? I did. I'm and, a, I'm a good digger. Uh, I came in here and finished it off. Yep. The little there was a story called the little digger, wasn't there? The little yellow digger. Do you remember that? No. No. Remember oh, Budgie okay, the then. little helicopter. Budgie the little helicopter. Yeah. Yeah. The whole theme tune. Budgie I remember something like that. Yeah. So I, I put some stairs in just to make it easier to get in and out of here. Okay. But this area is going to be like our mass storage area mm -hmm. down here. And the next level up under there is going to be more rooms and stuff. Mm -hmm. And then above the cobblestone, we're going to have two floors for the castle. Hey. Oh, I'm being attacked by a moth in here. A moth? Yeah, a moth just flew past my face. Did you open your wallet? No, I did not open my wallet. <laughs> <laughs> yes, how funny. I know. So I'm going to show you around up the top here. Start at the top. Because what I'm going to do, what I was going to do, did I, are you seen the train track changes, haven't you, and I everything? Have. Yeah, so this doesn't, we're not using End of the this. road. End of the road. <laughs> um, so this round bit of earth is actually going to be a turret that's going okay. to go up into the sky. Well, so that was a fantastic bit of screenshot was there, wasn't say, it? I was going to say, I should yep. have pressed the F2 button. Uh, so this is going to be some stairs going down. This is going to be changed into like a po uh, a concrete post or something. A totem pole. A totem pole. Well, that's okay. So this is the style of the stairs. So this is ground floor. I don't know what you would call it. What do you call below ground floor? Do you call it but like basement? Under basement floor. one. Basement two. I don't know. <laughs> minus one. Minus one. Minus one. Depends if you're in an elevator. So this is floor minus one. So I'm going to put earth across here to start with just to put a false floor in so we've got something to work with. Okay. So that's that stairs. Then we can go down another level here. I'll go in there in a minute because you helped in there. And this is ground floor or bottom. Ground. Not ground, ground floor. Ground. Ground, ground floor. And then I did another set of stairs down here, which is for future expansion. Okay. Should we decide to need to go deeper? I thought Minecraft. that sounds good. That's a sort of a bit of a joke, go deeper, because, you know, the whole Minecraft thing. So... What's that going to do in Minecraft? You, well, you get the achievement going deeper when you go to the nether. Oh, I see. Ah, yeah. So you helped with this. I did. You did a massive amount of digging in here. Yep, this is where we're going to help clear this out. Halo Phoenix's cars. <laughs> Your cars. <laughs> it's not very high, the roof then, is it, for it's cars? Low. <laughs> so this is actually going to be a massive dungeon we're going to build in here. It's cool. going to have eight cells. Ooh. And this is quite cool. I haven't been out this bit, actually. Oh, you see? I've been digging. So... 
Ooh, I hear a zombie. So this bit over here is going to sort of overhang out the mountain. So they might have a window in here for the inmates to look out of. And they'll be able to see out where they, you know, can't go because they're in prison. And then over this side, it obviously peeps out again into some of the hillside. And we'll have like a block here with windows and this will all be castle grounds. I see. But key thing is, I've actually been building some of the dungeons in oh, here. Get you. So this one's a lot smaller because you can't go that way because you go into the bottom of the castle keep. Oh. You know that bit that was just through oh, there. Yeah. yeah. So this is the general layout that I've done of the cells. So you can see we've got the wall here. These are going to be iron bars, which we're going to do in a minute. And these are the individual little cell rooms. Lovely. Like that. Mm -hmm. So there's one there and one there. Mm -hmm. And then there's another pair of cells at the back here. The back wall. And then there's a little doorway here, which allows you into this corridor or to go through to these. Okay. Yeah? Mm -hmm. I thought that looks quite good. Like that. So I was just going to come in here and put some of the... Oh, we're going to have a guard room over here. So I thought I brought some materials with me. We could just do that while we're here. Knock this up a bit and see okay. what we can do. It would have been helpful if I brought some iron with me. Luckily... I know where I'm going. Luckily... <laughs> would you like a map? <laughs> I've got an awful lot of iron in here. Ironing in here. Right, they're diamonds. They're irons. <laughs> uh, let's take a couple of stacks of iron. The smelting system of your idea was your idea, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. That's really worked well. Yeah. Melting all the uh, materials down. I've been very. I don't know where I'm going. That way. This way. That's it. I'm fine. Ooh. So iron bars. You make like that. Oh. Um, I don't know how many I'm going to need. 16 let's make another set and have a go see what we what we think cool. so we're gonna have them in there like that it's all very gray isn't it yeah and i'm gonna have them above the doors as well that does look really cool like that poor people and they'll be in there like that Oh, look at that. I used exactly 16 to make those. Like you knew. I, it is like I knew, wasn't it? Mm. I didn't. I would like to pretend <laughs> that I did actually know I this. what I was doing. <laughs> but actually, no. It's oh, not that look. good. Look at that. Oh, perfect. Okay. Look at that. That's awesome. I thought we'd use redstone torches in here because it'll make it more yeah. gloomy. Yeah, no, that'd be cool. So what we'll do now is we're going to make some iron doors. So it's three. Oh, look, I'm going to going to have some left over. Uh-oh. So if we put them there. Okay. Do you know about iron doors? Uh, no. So iron doors you can't open. So how do people get in? Or uh, out? That's sort of the point. Look, you can't do anything with them. So, there's just going to be... How do you put things in there then? Uh -huh. Like witches and zombies and scary stuff. Exactly. So, what we're going to do... Is you leave the door open, let them go in and then quickly shut the door. We're going to have four levers. Oh. I like and my what idea. we do... Because that's, that's a torch. A torch. <laughs> I know this one. That's a lever. Oh, I see. And should be that side. Of, should be that size, really, shouldn't it? Dink. And then we go. Ta da! Well, it, no wiring required. No. Because <laughs> it basically powers that block uh, when you flick the switch, and then it opens the door, which Thank is you. cool. And if somebody was to close that on the outside, I wouldn't be able to get out unless they could dig out. Where's Halo Phoenix when you need her? Uh, sitting right next to I me, know. luckily. Not playing in the game. Um. So what you would do with your prisoner <laughs> is bring them along and take all their armour off them, all their tools and everything. How do you do that? Well, you'd make them surrender everything when you arrest them. 
your prisoner. Okay. And then you'd put them in here, lock the door, and then they would be bashing the door because they can't dig it. Yeah? They'd be here forever. Well, not with a torch. Well, no, not with a torch. Yeah? Yep. Pretty cool? Yep. Right, let's go put ones on the other two doors. I could just do... Ta-da! There we go. So, how Let's find some prisoners. I haven't got any prisoners to put in. Me. Should we... Get, see, look, it's dingy now. Let's... Uh, it would help if I'd actually had commentary, wouldn't it, while I'm actually playing this game. So some redstone torches. Haven't got any redstone. I've got loads. There's loads in here as well. Uh, uh, not in no, there. No, wrong way. Uh, not in that no, way, that not way. way. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Note to self, get a sign made for him on PJC to go around his own little key place. So he knows where he's going, yeah, yeah exactly. Cool. I like the way you just got a random square, like... Gap in I think that was you. I don't think so. I think it was actually. I think you. Imagine did that. if you can like go like this, like bend and then go through it. Bend. And bend. And you ooh. probably. Can. What was that? Spider. Spider. Well, I left it dark enough in here. A spider spawned in here already. Yeah. Ah. We've now caught a spider. <laughs> oh man. You won't be able to get out of here either. Just put a debris down. Ah, kill him! Kill him! Ah! Kill him! <laughs> Our first prisoner! Ta-da! No Yay. one in this one, is there? Nope. Pull a couple prisoner. of red torches up. I was thinking more a witch or a zombie, not a spider, but I yep. can work with that. Look! <gasps> F2. <laughs> Do you want me to open the door and get a picture of it? He can't get through this door. Oh. <laughs> Oops, moments happen. That's but there's like good. loads down it. <laughs> it probably is now. <laughs> You've taken too long. Cool, yeah, this would be proper dark, wouldn't it? Like wouldn't this. It? Right, what do you hey, think? That looks really cool. That's got a bit more atmospherics to it, hasn't it? Get you. Yeah? Yep. Do so you like that idea? So, so what looked? else would we have in there? Um, what else can you think that we might have? Cauldron. Yeah. So why would we use a cauldron? To cook people in. No, I wasn't thinking of actually cooking the minute, actually. <laughs> uh, I'm just going to temporarily make a hole here so I can make a water source. Because uh, what I'm going to do is going to put water in the in the cauldron. Huh. So if I come over here. So why do you want a cauldron? Well, to feed it's people. A, it's a bit like you know where they're going to wash. You can wash your face. <laughs> yeah, that's basically all they're going to get. Do they not have a toilet? That's their toilet then. So they got washed and go to the toilet. They got a noisy prisoner next door. I know. Um, yeah, so that could be that. I mean, there'd be room for two beds in here. Yeah, yeah that would sort yeah. of fit, wouldn't it? Two beds. I haven't got enough materials to make because I haven't got any wool. Oh, I've got loads of wool. Have you? Yeah. Where? Um, in my home base. Oh, that's not helpful. Oh. Uh, uh, what about <laughs> if... You make a wooden bed. No, I was just thinking oh, of actually just. Well, yeah, we could use these as chairs, or but when you want we like could an use iron them. chair, not a wooden chair. Like, a what? Like an iron chair. Be quite cool if you like put table. If we put carpet on there, they would look like bunk, like dodgy bunk beds, wouldn't they? Would that work? Uh, yeah. You put stuff on top of that as well. Yeah, you can put stuff on those. So, can you have it like a bu an actual bunk bed? If or this not? room had been bigger, yeah, you could have oh. had another layer there and you could have had bunk beds up there. So, mm -hmm. you could have had four layers. That's pretty cool. But you could have, yeah, I mean, that would work like that. Mm -hmm. um, should we give them a chair? Would that look weird like that as a chair? I might change these into beds, actually. No, it's a combi bed, combi chair. So, then they can so flip it up if they want a longer bed. 
Uh, okay. Yeah, could do that. <laughs> and shall I make them a table? They've got to be able to sit somewhere to eat, haven't they? Yeah. Spider's so, freaking me out. I know, he's noisy, isn't he? Oh. I think we'll have to go in there. We're going to have to kill him anyway so that I can just... Um... You, have you lit the other rooms up? No, they've got normal torches in oh, them okay. at the moment. Uh, I'm running out of inventory space here because what I wanted to do is I think that's a pressure Push plate floor. yeah so what I can do is you can use a fence post uh, like that oh I saw this in one of the little villagers houses yeah and then put a pressure plate on top of it hey. and it looks like a little table oh that's cool question how would they be able to wash their face then because there's too much in front of it really Looks a bit like a sauna. A sauna? <laughs> well, it does. Look, that's, you can sit on that's, that's not the that's, sort of approach like... I was going for for this prison, <laughs> to be honest. Oh, well, yeah, because then you put the oh, water look, in, don't you? They've you got. Put the water oh, in. yeah, 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 yep, yeah, yeah, yeah. I reckon you're probably right there. Let's um, let's just have a look at this. Um, F2. Here I am in my sauna. sauna. Yeah, look, here I am. Hey. Oh, it's lovely and warm Doesn't in here. I like it, though. Oh, isn't it cute? No, that wasn't my plan at all. No, no not with a locked door on it, anyway. Oh, don't mind locking me in there if it's a sauna. It's all right. Oh, okay. Right, oh, fine. <laughs> so, um, is that too many torches? No, it's too dark. Yeah, it's too dark, isn't it? What's the... Oh, it's because I walked into the pressure plate. Ah. Put a torch over that bed, and we've got one over that bed like that, yep. and then one over the door. Lovely. Oh, that thing's freaking me out. Ugh. Yeah, I think that's the best position up there. Beautiful. Yeah, that's all right. I think that's quite cool. Sauna room A. Um, what about the floor? Is the floor all right? Just a stone, or should I put the odd bit of cobblestone in to break it up? I like it. Yeah, you like it like that? Yeah. I think that's good. Right, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to do the rest of the rooms like that. We're going to go and kill the spider. Woohoo! Because uh, he's being way too noisy. Ah, take you down. Ow! Ah, he fights back. That's it, that got Quick, you out Quick, put of a there. torture. Uh, do, 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 do. So where did we put one? We put one uh, there. One over there. One over there. One over there. One over there. We can check the light levels. What's the light levels in here like? Uh, yeah, it's a bit dark. We'll work it out. Yeah, they're probably still going to get stuff spawned in there, but that'll have to do for now. Okie dokie. Well, I'll work something out so that it's a bit dark, so it's a bit more lit in there so that we don't get stuff spawned in there. Okay. Put some lamps in or something. Oh, yeah. Yeah? Yep. Yeah. So what do you think? Does that look all right? I like it. It looks really good. And then my plan over here, very briefly, I'm going to put this together very quickly just to give you an idea. Okay. Um, so if I use some, like, cob uh, should I use cobble or wood? I think wood might look better. Okay. So if we grab some blocks of wood, like so... And we're going to build like a little desk area. One, two, three, four, um, five. Let's put a couple like that. And we'll make a little gate round here so that people can get in and out. That torch is way too close now. Oh, cool. Yeah. It's a bar. It looks a bit like a bar. It's a bar. But if the prisoners get thirsty. <laughs> what we're going to do is we're going to put one of them there and one of them there. Oh, it's definitely a bar now. And maybe... Now, we could either have, like, wooden planks along there or should I... Oh, I know. What about if we do this? So if I get six of them... That's where the glasses will go. Oh, I need some more of them. Uh -oh. uh, what do I need? Uh, more planks. Ta-da! 
kind of one like that. And there it looks oh, like a little bar. like control room. <laughs> it's not a bar. <laughs> what is it with the whole sauna and bar thing that we've got going on here? That's very bizarre. Very. I, I don't know what sorts of spas you go to. Well, they have a bar. <laughs> they have a bar. <laughs> Apparently so. Right, uh, here's my... It's called the tower. What, what, what do you call it? The pièce de, de résistance or whatever? <laughs> Please say that again. <laughs> pizza, pizza de, de résistance. Pizza? It's a pizza shop now. <laughs> yeah, something like that. Oh, that didn't work. The line. Please wait while I try to break a, a slab. Slab. Chocolate. <laughs> there we go. Look, a chair. Oh, look. How cool is that? Wait, wait, wait. You want a picture I'm of the chair? I'm seriously impressed with this. Oh, look oh, at that. Oh, see, you're in. Can, can you actually sit in it? No. Oh. It looks really cool, though, doesn't it? You should have, like, a torch on the back of it. <laughs> that would be fun. Yeah. How's that look? Oh, that looks cool. Wait, wait, wait. Ding. Yeah. Yep. So this will be like the guard room. The guard can sit there, and maybe what we'll do is we'll put some bits along the surface here as well, yep. like some books for registering the the guard, the the prisoners coming in and out. Yep. And maybe we can put some things over here, like some chests or some framework and things, and make this a little bit more dangerous looking and everything. Okay. Um, I like uh, what you did before with the whole um, lava behind the bars. Lava behind the bars. Yeah, that in might be museum. a good way of doing lighting in here yeah, as well. Yeah, I'm Because uh, one thing I definitely like doing um, is where you dig a couple of holes back and put a torch in deep and then put a half slab and then you just get a little bit of light creeping out the bottom. Oh, okay. That looks pretty cool. So yeah, I might do, do something, something like that. that as well. But yeah, I'm going to mess around with that and sort of put a bit more in. But yeah, I don't think this looks too bad actually. Yeah, it looks really cool. Um, let's just move into a decent position so I can wave goodbye to everyone. But yeah, that's not too bad, is it? No. That looks quite cool. I think it looks cool. Yeah? Yep. Did you enjoy that? I did. Yep. Give me so some ideas. I've got to build eight more of them on the other side. Wow, that keep me busy. That will keep me busy. And I've got to put a bit more decoration in here as well, make it look, look a bit more... Uh, lived in so to speak Homely. looks a little yeah looks a little bit clean and tidy at the moment Homely for prisoners. look there's a good screenshot there yay there we go Ta -da. right thanks everyone for watching i hope you've enjoyed this episode yep uh maybe next episode we could get you to come in and play with us okay yeah yeah go for it yeah go on then uh maybe do some more building work yeah. and maybe you can help out a bit of the interior decorating i'll try it's not really my You've not tried that bit yet, have you? No. Just been doing the digging. Yep. Okay. Right. Thanks, everyone. Thank See you. you later. Please subscribe and leave a like. Bye. Bye.